up, Dykes fam? What's up? We hope you guys are doing awesome today. Mom, how are you doing? Good. We don't have any kids. This is like a mom and dad official date. And this yeah. never happens anymore because the kids don't go to school or sports or anything right now. So, we're always having them here. It's really, really quiet. Listen. I can hear my thoughts. <laughs> Hey, so we are actually doing something towards our house today. Oh my gosh, we... Something we've been working on for several weeks. Building a house is just a million times harder than we could have ever imagined. We built a house a few years ago, but we had like a builder in a subdivision and like he did everything and it was great. Everything. Step one is getting finished today. We're so excited. We're getting water for our well. So we're, we're buying, closing on that. We're buying a water right that That's you have called. to use for the well that we have to drill on yeah. our property. Yeah, and this costs like a ridiculous amount of money, all these little things. Like we have to get water, we have to get sewer, we have to get power, we have to get gas, all these things run to our house, which we didn't know was gonna cost like a crazy amount of money. So we're taking care of the first step and we've got somebody lined up to come out and look at the power for us and we have somebody lined up to come out and test the soil and make sure that we can put in a septic system for our house. So we're super excited. In other news, our RV is back in the shop. We had it in the shop. Yeah. And just found out uh, two days ago that they were unable to fix it. It's having some structural It's issues. falling apart. The um. wall <laughs> is coming away from the floor. And yeah. as I'm driving, I can see the road below. <laughs> it's not safe. Yeah, after six people being crammed in there and living in there, and Josh hitting lots and lots of potholes. I hit them all. It's falling apart, for real. And the people that we took it to said it wasn't actually our fault. It was the way that the RV was made. And so we have to take it somewhere professionally to get fixed. So we have no home. It's costing so much money. We don't have an RV right now. We're crammed in Josh's parents' house. And we're homeless, but we are optimistic. The future looks bright. <laughs> we're excited today to check out a couple of things off the list towards our home and we're hoping today will be a good day and we're going to go get this signed and then we'll check in with the kids a little bit later. Hang out with us today guys. Getting ready to sign. I want that water. Would you sign here please ma'am? <laughs> we're done. That was easy. That was easy huh? And they're giving us an ice cream bar. Guys, we got done signing for our water right. Got that all wrapped up. Now it's just a waiting game to get that into our names. Then we have to apply to move it to our property. So it's a long process, but we want to document this journey. And on our way home, we had to stop and pick up the truck because we just got two brand new tires put on it. And then on my way home, there is cattle crossing. It's like some farmer's trying to move his cows and they're just here on the main highway. There's like probably a hundred of them and I can't get through it. Guess I could have taken the shortcut. This is typical country life. Check this out. I'm from the country and I like it that way. Country yeah. life. This is what happens when mom and dad aren't here. <laughs> The kids party, they eat lots of junk food. Junk food! And they yeah! go out to the pool, get in their swimsuits and have oh, some fun. You guys having a swimming party out here? Yes. You, you got your little swimming pool going? I got purple popsicle. Got a purple popsicle in the pool? Sounds like an awesome day. Yeah. Who's ready for the Who Could Hold Their Breath Longest Contest? Who's going first? Okay, you ready, boys? Tate and Nicole, you gotta count it out with us, okay? In three, two, one. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand. Thirty-one thousand, forty-one thousand. Oh, William! Huddy's still going! Huddy, you win! All your hair! Huddy, don't ruin that awesome new perm you got, dude. By swimming. I can't get it wet though. <laughs> Who's going against Natalia? I'll go. Okay. Tatum versus Talia. Oh, Let's see it. 
Okay, ready? One, two. Oh, the water's actually okay. One, two, three. <gasps> One, two, three, four, twelve, thirteen. Oh, Tayden, you quit already? What? I told you. How are you ever gonna swim with sharks? Natalia's a winner! I'll we'll just use an air tank. An air tank? Okay, you guys keep having fun out here. Okay, for round three, we have winner Hudson versus winner Natalia, AKA bro versus. All right. Who's gonna win? Nikoi, who do you think's gonna win? Three, two, one, go. <gasps> One thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand, six. Oh, Hansa is the all-time holding your breath in the tiny swimming pool champion. Hudson, how does it feel? <laughs> Guys, Hudson is the king of the pool, so that means you have to listen to whatever he tells you. Get him all the snacks and fun things he wants today, okay? Good job, King Hudson! Okay, do a cannonball, everybody. One, two, three, cannonball! <laughs> Five dollars to whoever dunks Nikoi. Okay! <laughs> Uh-oh. I don't know. Hey, time for a little water balloon fun, huh? Oh, yeah. Bunch of balloons! This video is not sponsored by Bunch of Balloons, but it should be. <laughs> I'm going to throw it at that perm. Big perm. No, no, go, go, go! Koi, look at how big they are! <laughs> Oh, got her. Oh, got it. Don't get me wet. Oh, she's not happy. <laughs> don't get. Hey, don't get mad at me. I didn't do it. <laughs> oh, thanks. I like hugs. Especially because it's so hot out here. I'll get it for you. Oh, I feel good. Oh. No, 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 no. Throw that at you? Yeah. Not hard, not that hard. Okay, ready? Yeah. Be tough. Turn and face me. I'll throw it at your chest. Ready? Did that hurt? <laughs> Rozzy, throw that at Tay Tay. <laughs> hey, that's splashed on Dad. You got me. Good. We got a farmer over here and a gardener, Christina. Hey. What you doing over here? Welcome to our garden. We're growing straw. We haven't shown you guys for a while what's been going on, There's but a rule. I don't like eating straw. <laughs> <laughs> He'd rather eat hay. Um, Grandpa Tommy today, he taught us the beauty of a garden drip system. If you guys have ever had a garden, this is like the best way to yeah, water it. Me, Who taught you? Uncle Rick. Rickopedia. His brother. <laughs> we actually uh, have been doing a lot of work. We have just put in this frost freeze tap over here. We've been digging up my dad's yard. We spent a day digging all this stuff up, broke a few pipes, learned a few lessons. But we got the frost freeze tap in, frost free, frost freeze, frosty freeze. And then we got the house water turned back on. You guys didn't know about that, but uh, it was shut off for like a whole day. We started at 11 o'clock in the morning and then the pipes broke and we didn't have water again until 9 o'clock at night. And with the many people as we have living in this house, it got a little scary. But luckily the boys had an outside bathroom, right? Yeah. <laughs> But guys, look, our peas are coming up and they're getting so big. Guys, these are peas right here. The kids are so excited. Look at all the little vineys coming off. Look, of and it. we got little creatures in here. Hey, the sign of a healthy garden is actually bugs, so don't be afraid of them. Look at that. 
Uh, so we got more beets. beets. Those are beets. Check out our beets. I don't know if you guys like beets. I can eat them, but they are so good for you, and yeah. I love them. And then we've got carrots and spinach, and check out my sad tomatoes. They actually got frozen the other day because it got so cold here. Yeah, but speaking of so cold, it's we'll not. Show them how they're dead. It's not cold today at all. So of course, like three days ago, my tomatoes froze, and then today it's 95. Go figure. So hot. <laughs> Yeah, these tomato plants have seen better days. <laughs> but they're coming back. And then we might do some corn. Down here, two more rows of corn. Said no. My dad said no. <laughs> Christina's out here weed in the morning glory. And she... if any of you need a summer job, there is plenty of morning glory to weed. Yeah. Well, we if have... you have any secrets on how to get rid of it, please let me know. We have a whole bunch of kids that are going to come pull it. I know. They need to get out here for sure. But check out our garden. We're so excited. It's beautiful guys. Um, give this video a thumbs up if you guys have ever grown a garden. It's the best. It's fun. Don't be breaking grandpa's fans. We're just doing a little uh, cousin football out here. Cousins and uncle. Yeah! <laughs> Watch out for that fence. Took a kitty cat time out. Hey, look, there's our cat. Good job, Bubba! Hey, you remind me of Tecker's kid. Oh, Substitution, the coys hurt. Next touchdown wins. You guys are in double overtime. Here we go.
Touchdown, Talia! With the game-winning touchdown! <laughs> hey, good job, cousins! Is your head gonna See fall what off? Yes. What, what did you do to yourself? She's uh, sticking her hair in pink blood. You putting Kool-Aid in your hair? Are you gonna drink your hair after? No. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm dyeing my hair red, but it's 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 cool because it's super easy and it it comes down in a few weeks. Oh, so it's just temporary. Mm -hmm. And what color did you use? Red. What's the Kool-Aid flavor? Black cherry. You use black cherry? Yeah. <laughs> it's not actually black. Yeah, it's yummy though. It smells yummy, huh? Yeah. I'm tempted to drink it. <laughs> I'll do it. And Koi's got bloody bags on her hair. <laughs> That's what it looks like. What are you doing now? Uh, you soaked them for like 15, 20 minutes? Yeah. And now you're just letting them continue to marinate in that bloody bag? Dad, stop! <laughs> we'll show you her bloody hair color when she's done. Farm line. She thinks my tractor's sexy! <laughs> Oh man. Come on, throw her down, Tom. Yeah, you gotta watch out for the old Ford 1900. Oh, watch out, Troy boy. Don't die. Tom's a crazy driver. Watch out, Troy boy. He's gunning for you. Yeah, there we go, old Blue. Get it, old Blue. <laughs> Dykes kids are getting some dinner. Hey, are we partying or what? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That looks ridiculous. Just don't let that get into your watermelon drink. Where'd it go? Oh, over yeah, here. <laughs> it's about the same color. Watermelon. Hey girls, what are we doing tomorrow? Uh, we're going to someplace fun. We're going on an adventure. <laughs> we're going on an adventure. That's right, we're going on a little mini trip. Yeah, with yeah. our whole family. Who's excited? Me. Oh. It's kind of like a staycation. Yeah. 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 Boys are ready to go on a little vacay. Okay. If they want to know where we're going, they need to come back tomorrow and check it out, right? Yeah. Okay, what do we tell the Dykes fam? We'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out, Dykes fam. What's going on in here? You're supposed to be in bed.